stuck in traffic may be a thing of the past as the flying car is finally unveiled. What's up guys, my name is Sam and you are tuned in to IO. We've all been there guys, running late for an appointment, stuck in bumper to bumper traffic, biting on the steering wheel, listening to Miley what? No. I do not listen to Miley Cyrus in my car. However, there's always that daydream that one day your car is just gonna sprout wings and coast very easily over all the construction and the bad drivers and deliver you directly to the front door of where you need to be. Well, keep dreaming big folks because we are just one step closer to that amazing dream as the Aeromobile 2.5 was revealed this past week at the air show exhibition Aerotech in Montreal. Now I know you're all going to be wanting to put this on your Christmas list, so here's a few, few facts about your future ride. Now this impressive vehicle can drive on regular roads like any other car, but then kaboom, it can spread its wings and it can hit the skies. It reaches speeds of just 99 miles per hour while it's on the ground and 124 once it hits the air. The two seat machine is the brainchild of the Aeromobile team who've been working on the concept since 1990. That's 13 years in the making and they have given us a car that can not only be fueled at regular gas stations but also because its wings are able to tuck in and fold away, it can also go in a regular parking space. Oh, genius. It weighs 450 kilograms, has a takeoff speed of just 90 miles per hour so you could literally take off from the highway if you wanted to. So although this is only a prototype, the creators are very sure that this is going to pave the way for door-to-door -door travel. But don't get too excited. You can't drive your car and then fly across the Atlantic, for example, because it does only have a 430 mile reach, but I will take it. I will take it and I will fly it and I will look down below at all the little ants that are stuck in traffic. But are we just asking for trouble? I mean, imagine taking road rage and putting it in the air. Seems dangerous to me. But what do you guys think? Are you excited about the concept of a flying car? Clearly I am. Let me know what you think in the comments below.